John, you, you and I have talked a lot about EMPs, and I don't know why God seemingly brought that to us over, what, three, four years now at least. Major, major people and speakers have come to this show with the EMP bomb. Yes. And you brought it up again, and William, you, you believe it's a threat. You Abs believe it's absolutely. We have, it, is a, it is our number one threat, Jim, to our homeland. No, did you hear what he said? Well, when you have former CIA Director James Woolsey and that group of people that have been calling for reinforcement or power grid for Why it, didn't these are very credible fix it? Run on it, run for president it's on like, it. It's like our Achilles heel. It's like, you know, our blindness. You know, it's, you know. I think it, Korea, North Korea knows more about uh, it than we do, about it, our, it's so, our weakness. So is Iran. And we're, and, track, I, and we're tracking every one of their container ships. Mm. You know, we're very concerned about this. But see, here in America, we've taken our homeland security for granted. This won't happen. It never happens here. It won't happen in America. Mm. Just like the world was blown away when Hurricane Katrina happened. Well, you're always helping us in disasters all over the world. They couldn't believe that something of the magnitude of Katrina happened in America. Right. And now Harvey and now Irma. They couldn't comprehend it. So if God is going to wake up America, it could be a, you know, we have five grids, four or five, maybe five grids in America. Mm -hmm. Texas has its own, and there's four other grids. Mm -hmm. we're, we're extremely vulnerable to an EMP attack. It won't happen unless God allows it, though. 